Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Anna Jolene and I'm the author of the Glorium C series as well as the Moonrise Beach series. So I'm here to do another plan with me and my Hobonichi cousin. You guys have been really loving these videos so I thought that I would do a few more. So this is the kit that I decided on using this week. I have the deco sheet that goes with this Twilight Garden collection. This is actually a really popular collection in the shop right now. Um, I can't seem to keep it in stock. So um, I'm really happy that you guys have been loving it, but um, I like to use a deco sheet to help me decorate the page, but I use the Hobonichi Cousin Weekly Kids as my base. So that is what I'm going to be putting down today to set up for the following week, which is January the 9th to the 15th and you can purchase this here in the white mat that's what I have here and you can also now purchase it in the clear mat option so that um, clear mat option kit is available in my main shop my main website not on Etsy so if you're looking for the clear stickers go to my main website okay so um, with the two page kit here we have some full boxes full boxes that you can write in half boxes you have your date covers and the bottom washi. You have also some checklists, page flags, and scallop corners. And then you have an array of different boxes here. So scallop one, scallop headers, decorative headers, um, habit trackers as well, and then also a weekly sidebar. So everything that you need is already here in the one kit. Then I have my date numbers here, which I will be using this week to number all of my days. And again, this is from my shop, so if you guys are interested in purchasing from my shop, you guys can use the code SAVE10 to save 10% off. This week has been super, super busy. I've been fulfilling the Boxing Day orders. I'm still working on those because I had so many orders come in and they were really, really big ones. Some of them were like my biggest orders ever, so... Um, it is taking me a while to go through them. I'm almost done. Hopefully I can get it done within the next couple of days or so um, because I do want to um, start promoting the clear or transparent stickers for the shop. Um, I have put up a poll just today actually asking um, what kind of stickers or kits that you guys want to see made into clear stickers because um, I wasn't sure what you guys wanted. So I know for sure I'm going to be making them for the journaling kits that we have in the shop. So you'll be able to grab that in the white mat option or the transparent mat. Um, but a lot of you guys have also voiced that you wanna see these kits, the Hobonichi Cousin kits, also as um, clear options in the shop. So um, that is something that I'm going to start doing now. Um, I need to just adjust the settings on the listings so that um, there's an option for clear mat now. So when using clear mat, um, you are going to need to use like a different type of pen. Let me see if I have the pen handy. No, I don't. Well, it's the Sakura Microperm one. Um, I don't have one to show you. I don't know where I put it, but that is the pen that I would recommend you using on clear matte if you do wish to write on these stickers. Um, but if you don't want to bother with, you know, like using a different pen, then just go with this option, which you can use any pen with. So I am gonna go ahead and add my weekly sidebar stuff. So I have been adding my two trackers here. One is for self-care and then the other one I use just for PR. So I'll be adding those two here. And then also I'm going to take my goals header and then this will be kind of like whatever I want to accomplish this week. And then I'll label this as this week. This is going to be for my meals. Okay, so let me double check my calendar here. This week I actually don't have anything planned, which is very rare for me. But next week, as you guys can see, I have so many things, including um, my actual deadline for my book. So even though this week is going to be 
uneventful. Um, I have a lot of things to prepare for for next week. So that is what I'm going to be focusing on. So I'm not going to need any event stickers. I'm just going to go straight into my checklist. And I think I'm going to do one maybe like... Well, let's see, I have four of these full boxes. So let me put these ones down and I'll put them in a staggered pattern because like I said, I don't have any events this week so I can kind of do whatever I want, which is kind of nice. So normally I would pay attention to the timeline a little bit more than this, but this time I am just gonna go ahead with putting it anywhere I like. So this one, I think I'll make it higher. And then I'm gonna have another checklist on this day. And I'm gonna be using the decorative headers this time on each of those. So how have you guys been enjoying using your Hobonichi Cousin? Are you guys using it again this year? This is actually my third year using the Hobonichi Cousin. So I'm really enjoying it. But I know some people are using the Hobonichi Cousin like for the very first time this year. So that's kind of exciting. Let me know how that is working out for you guys. I know sometimes there's like a little bit of a learning curve with the layouts in here. So hopefully seeing these plan with me videos and my flip throughs, you guys can get a few ideas. So I am gonna be having a new release on Monday. So I do need to mark that down. So I'm going to write here. New release. Um, it's also going to be payday. Um, I also need to go to the post office and I want to do some shopping on this day as well. Actually, let's use a lighter color first. So, I can, so I'm gonna write down post office and then shopping. And then for shopping, I think I'll just use one of these scallop corners just for something different. Okay. Um, and then Tuesday, I have a couple of things to film, so I will film a cousin plan with me. And then I also want to film my memory planner flip through. So maybe I'll split it up into two. I don't know, we'll see. It might have to be two videos because I think flipping through a whole entire year might be a little long. So we'll see about that. Um, and then Wednesday, I will just be editing. So I'm gonna add maybe one of these flags. I can just add it here, oops. So edit. Um, and then on Thursday, I wanna go see my mom. So I will leave that marked down here. Friday, I don't have anything planned other than watching a show that comes out usually. So that's in the evening. And then Saturday, again, I will be filming. Let's just use another scallop. and then also editing, and then Sunday. Sunday I might leave just blank for now. And then let me fill in some of my um, sections here. So I'm going to write self-care in these trackers and PR. And then for my sidebar, I want to start working on my next um, book that's gonna be published after the one that's coming out in February, if that makes sense. So the one that's coming out in summertime. 
So I'm just going to read it through one more time just to make sure. And then after that, I do need to do the front and back matter of that book. So that just means the dedications, acknowledgements, note to readers and things like that. Um, I also want to design a Sakura collection for the shop. I think it'll be really nice for spring. And then actually on this side here, um, I will write down that I need to prep a blog post and also a newsletter for next week. And then I am going to be adding transparent mat, like I said, to the shop. So I'm just gonna add that here. So moving on to Saturday, I'm just going to be writing some of the chores that I need to do. So laundry, clean the bathroom, also, I need to vacuum. And then on Thursday, I just want to prep a email for my editor that is going out. And that might be it, I think. So that's everything in terms of actually what is going on. And then I do have this gorgeous deco sheet that I will be using to kind of decorate. So since Sunday is kind of free, I will go ahead and add some of those pieces. Let me know if you guys would like me to also make these deco sheets like in clear. I could probably do that too. You just can never tell. So just let me know if there is anything else that you guys would like to see in the shop. I like to come up with my own ideas, but obviously it's always nice to hear from you guys. So I'm not gonna go too crazy because things may pop up and I may not have the space. So I think we'll just leave it as that. And as you guys can see, I still have quite a bit that I can use to fill up the rest of this spread but I think that might be it in terms of the pre-planning so if you guys follow me on Instagram I will share how my week looks like after it's all filled in so my Instagram handle is Anna Jolene author if you guys don't follow me already but once again if you guys are interested in the Twilight Garden kit then you guys can use a code save 10 to save 10% off if you have any questions, you can leave them down below. And please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.